What's up, everybody? This is Chris. This is Austin. And this is Jason. And we're back with more No More Heroes. When we last left off, we went through this uh, stadium that, that apparently uh, is a baseball stadium. Yep. And now we're on our way to fight the boss. Yep, we are fighting Dr. Peace. If you couldn't tell, those are bullets. A blood, old man. Sadly, I can't disagree. There's only one way to live. People like us, we're sharks attracted to blood. You smell blood too, didn't you? Isn't that why you're here? You got it, old man. And for some reason, I feel this sense of euphoria. Don't die on me too quickly. I want to gorge myself on this sense of fulfillment till I vomit. Man, this is what I live for. Fighting your own kind. Nothing is more gratifying. See you on the other side. Did Silvius just hire us to kill a country singer? Problem. Like seriously, we're fighting off against this uh, man who who just wanted a, a nice dinner with with his, with his family. He already got that though. So this is uh, Doctor Peace. So tell us what do what do we have to look out for? Um. Well, he has two golden magnums. What he's gonna do is that he's gonna charge up, fire a uh, big shot, and then uh, you can hit him from there. That that's. That's if you if you get close enough, however. Of course, he'll fire a rapid fire shot, but you don't have to necessarily dodge that. This is the shot you have to look out for. It's quick draw. Now. Well, this fight definitely looks awesome. Eh, it's really not. <laughs> Man, a real life scam. Fucking like guy with golden magnum shooting at you. And the baseball stadium. Come on. With, tell me with, that's not all. With an infinite amount of bullets, no less. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, I will tell you one thing that's absolutely awesome, no question. The freaking golden magnum. That's a badass gun. Sorry, I have to recharge. Oh, he was already on the pitcher's mound. That was 
<laughs> what happens if he does hit you with that shot? Uh, no matter like no matter what, even if you're uh, standing still to block him, uh, you uh, you uh, get knocked down. I see. And then what? Does it cause a lot of damage? Yeah, pretty much. It's been a while since I played this game. I don't remember everything, but I remember like yeah, when you shoot when you shoot that quick draw shot, it it pretty much hurts like hell. Reach for the sky. I'll tell you one thing, though, this boss seems kind of easy. Also, if he gets you uh, caught in that uh, barrage of uh, shots, you can just dodge out of that to save some uh, battery power. He has a pretty easy to predict pattern once you figure it out. It's not really even a pattern, it's literally the thought by the way, continually new... moving and you just won't get hit by his shot. By the way, we got a new suplex. Basically, a uh, butterfly suplex. Huh. Yeah, that's what, that's what he didn't get to see when he left to use the restroom. It's called something different, but I call it the Butterfly Suplex. Reason why? Uh, WWE. <laughs> You're funny. By the way, the boss scene is actually pretty boring. I think it's okay. The thought of the boss battle is good, but... Not nah, well, it's too easy. easy. I mean, what could be really that hard about dodging? Like I said, it just seems like you gotta keep moving. And if you're all ma automatically blocking that barrage, don't get me wrong, it can steal your battery charge away, but... That's about it. Yeah. I mean, heck, when, when he's uh, after the barrage, you can pretty much uh, uh, re uh, recharge when, he, uh, when you know he's doing the quick draw. Sorry about that, we had a little interruption. Yeah, it's nothing minor, so we're not gonna cut it out. I can I can just cut it out, don't worry. Look, he's almost dead, and I'm and I've been barely doing anything. Yeah. Butterfly suplex? That does a lot of damage to him, by the way. Almost dead. Ow. Dick. So what now? Yes, it's Get close to my <laughs> Don't kid yourself. Playtime is over. Quick drop. Just cut up his gut. Ow. Got anything to say about that? So now, saying I know my daughter will love, won't you, darling? <coughs> Better practice my rap. Rap <laughs> with me. <laughs> practice his rap. Uh. Good night. Hell, old man. Sing all you want down there. Can we at least take his uh, golden magnums? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I would like to. Aww. Confined by video games. Damn you, restrictions. By the way, since seven, we can, seven. since we uh, kept a seven, we got um, we got ten thousand points. Woohoo! Oh, nice. Which means more money. That helps. But um, yeah, he dies in a pretty pro provocative position. A position? Again, I can't talk. So let's punch this. Money and vitality. Yay, health upgrades. I love health upgrades. My hey. favorite kind of upgrades. Hey Sylvia, did you just hire me to kill kill a singer? Yes, do you have any problem with that? No. Congratulations. You are now ranked number nine. What you expect? Wait a minute. Are you getting a little sentimental? Still green, aren't you? 
You know this is only the beginning. Call me when the next one's arranged. Game set! That's tennis! <laughs> wow. Oh, that, that, that was funny. Marvelous! Marvelous. Alright. Wonderful! Okay, so you can stop now. Oh, Bitch absolutely. So we just took down uh, Dr. Peace. Yay. And that means whoever was number 11 is now number 10. Because unlike Mad World, people don't come back. Oh. I don't feel too bad about that. I mean, seriously, Dr. Peace was kind of an asshole. So let's uh, take another dump. Woo! And sure, let's save. Of course, we have to save. You have a problem with dropping a nice save? <laughs> nice one. Okay, I'll give you props for that. Woohoo! Shh! Hi, this is Diane from Beef Head Videos. This is a message for Mr. Travis Touchdown. Just calling to remind you that you haven't returned one of our rentals. Let's see here. It's um, titled. Big German Jug Collection number 23. Be sure to return it soon. Have a nice day. Congratulations, Mr. Touchdown. Your registration for the ninth UAA rank is now complete. Thank you very much for your cooperation. In addition, we have faxed you some information about the rankings in case you wish to continue your ascent. As a friendly reminder, there will be a small, nominal fee to participate in ranked fights. Thank you for your understanding, and have a nice day. Shut up and let me watch my porn! Kinda just sounds like school to me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, um, we need- The next uh, amount of money we need for the entry fee is 2,000. 200,000. 200,000. How much uh, do we have? I don't know. Maybe we'll see once we get outside. But anyways, let's play with Jean. Ah, such a cute kitty. Aww. I guess Jason doesn't like cats. Not that I don't like cats, just virtual ones are weird. To I think, be fair. <laughs> I think this is actually a good stopping point for this episode, so... No, not really. We should probably try and... Naomi's lab is now open, and Thunder Ryu building is now open. And Area 51. Oh, boy. And a new part-time job's available. I don't really want to stretch this into the 20-minute mark, because... I'll at least show off the, uh, shops. Okay, show off the shops real quick. I don't want to stretch it into the 20-minute mark, because then it'll take fucking forever. So upload to YouTube? True. Well, again, we can just cut it into, like, 15 minute sections. No, no, let's not do that. Why not? It's just, it's perfect the way it is. It's... No, it's not. We can no get... editing! <sighs> yes, no. Just put... We're just gonna put part four as part four, and part five as part five. Alright, so... okay. No ifs, ands, or buts. Oh my god, it's missing! No! No, I'm kidding. No, this is actually uh, Thunder Ryu's gym. I think you know who Thunder Ryu is, Austin. Yes, I know who Thunder know. Ryu is. You want that, right? Did he just ask to take off our clothes? Or no, he's asking us to do that. Whatever that is. Take off your clothes, what? Off, <laughs> Need your clothes, off to do that! Yeah, 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 wanna start? Get naked! Now stick your butt out. Out! Hold still. Can't kill no one unless you... <laughs> okay, this is just really provocative. This is just really wrong. Not your arms, your hips. Haven't you ever taken a dump in a Japanese-style toilet? Oh <laughs> Strong Strong stance. Excellent. Just like that. <laughs> now your underpants off. What the fuck? I need an adult. We are right. I know. You want to learn that, right? That's okay. Keep your clothes on. The That music sounds familiar. Oh boy. So let's um so what we can do here is um we can uh, 
we can uh, train to actually have our bean katana be not only stronger, but have a longer uh, combo strand. There's really nothing to this. I say that as it lags on me. Look at me, I'm exercising. If only if it was this easy in real life. Yeah. Finished. I got my money's worth. Now we have the combo extended. Let's see what we can get from this. Bench press. Oh, this will be fun. Mash the shit out of the Avon. Team Rocket's blasting off at the speed of light! <laughs> I wish this guy... I can hate the mashers! <laughs> it gets really asshole when once you get the other bean katars and you have to do this. <laughs> Come on, three more! Fuck's sake! This is how you lift weights in real life, Chris. M mash the shit out of the apron? No, you strain a lot. Fuck's sake. I hope this is worth it. Mm. Strength increased by a little bit. Fuck you. Just a little bit. Now let's do the squats. Well, strength in your right thumb increased a little bit too. Among other things. Squat thrust. Travis will become a professional humper. Okay. Push. Foreshadowing. Not really. Yeah, that's not really foreshadowing. Now we got a vitality increase. Woohoo! Health upgrades. Yeah. Oh, that leaving already? That. That's it. Come again. Wait for you. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> he made me take out my clothes. He made me take off my clothes! Weird. Yep, now you can't sleep tonight. Nope, not at all. So, um, now, now that there's a new job at the job center, we can actually uh, do another job to get another assassination mission. Well, look, but uh, I wanted to at least show off the stores first. Let's show off the stores, and then the next part will be about jobs. And Sim maybe a little bit of the next level. Maybe. Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit, yeah. Just a tiny bit. Now if we just park our bike in the middle of the road... Let's go to Naomi's lab. Naomi's lab. Naomi. Sorry, I knew a girl in uh, high school named Naomi. Oh, Naomi, please. Ha, 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 get it. Huh. Don't lay a finger on anything, I'll just kill you guys. Whoa! Look at those jugs. Uh, Oh, never mind. Um, uh, really? We don't have enough for this? Uh, no. Please tell me I have enough. We need to get it. Accelerator. Even Katana Accelerator. Yeah, you have enough. A sensor that can locate buried... No, I don't need that. Luckily, with the uh, next job, we can actually uh, do stuff with that. Alright, one more store and then we're done. Yep, time to go to Area 51. Which you'd think would actually be um, a pretty bad place to go, but it's actually a clothing store. I'll take that over the real area, 51. Hmm. Damn. You know, area 51 is fake. It's, it's real. It's really area 52. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't care what anyone says. Those live action Looney Tunes movies were actually pretty cool. You like Space Jam? Yeah. Okay then. I'm not singing the song though. So anyways, this is Area 51. <coughs> what is Area 51, you may ask? Well, like I said, it's a clothing store. So, come in, brother. Wait, Father Gregory? From Half-Life 2? Oh. Don't judge a book by his cover, okay? This is just my personal style. 
A man should stick to his guns, you know? Make good selection, bro. Before, Be sure before you purchase, okay? If you don't make up your mind soon, I'll have to stop letting you in here, bro. I'm going nuts here. I'm hard on myself and my customers, but that's just the uh, right way to do things, you know? Oh fuck, it's the Kingdom Hearts 2 virus. Sorry. Let's see, um, we can uh, customize uh, Travis here. So With Clothes. Mm-hmm. So I want black sunglasses. Let's see, uh, black jacket. Um... I think I'll stick with the shirt I have right now. Radio? Oh, no. Black pants. Okay. Well, that's cool. And then, black belt. Hey look, I'm a black belt. Huh? Huh? Not funny. Good one. Take care now, brother. Take care now, brother. Just said it for me. Why do we even need the text? Alright, so I guess that's good enough for now, so... So, uh, next time we'll see you guys, we'll uh, do some more uh, jobs, and then we'll actually take on the next level. So, this has been Chris. This has been Austin. And Jason. We will see you guys later.